On talk about this, a lot of people are wondering why is it taking so long to count these ballots and get the final results in Arizona when other states seem to be able to do it much quicker than we do. It all comes down to what's in Arizona state law, but the long waiting game here already has officials talking about the possibility of making some changes. Brianna Whitney's on this part of the story. She's at the Maricopa County Election Center to explain this law and how it differs from other states. Brianna. Well, much of this issue is the record number of early ballots that were dropped off on Election Day, nearly 300,000 of those, all of which now need to be signature verified, and that's a pretty robust process here in Arizona. But if the law were changed, we likely would have known the outcome of all races on Election Night. The wait is on to find out the winners of Arizona's closest races that will have national impact no matter which way they go. In Arizona, we're still waiting because of a law. The state statute does allow you to drop off that early ballot until 7 p.m. on election day. Maricopa County recorder Stephen Richer is referring to Title 16 in Arizona law that gives voters the legal right to do that. But many have asked, how can a state like Florida know their election results on election night? Maricopa County Chairman Bill Gates addressed that Thursday. Florida does not allow for mail-in ballots to be dropped off on, at voting locations on election day. So they don't allow it at all. We do. We want to clarify that, though. According to Florida elections, you can drop off a mail-in ballot day of until 7 p.m. too. You just have to take it to your Florida County Election Center as opposed to our state where you can take it to any polling location. Another difference between the two states. Florida, those races were blowouts. Nobody's paying attention anymore. Meanwhile, in Arizona, several of our races are so tight they can't be called yet, so we're getting national attention. So could we ever see results on election night in Arizona? You could propose a change to say, you can't do that anymore. If you're an election day voter, get in line. Political consultant Chuck Coughlin says just like any law change, it would have to work its way through the state legislature. But he says it would literally be a night and day difference if changes were made to early ballot deadlines. So if they didn't allow late early drop off day of, right? how much sooner would we find out results? Election night. County officials say there's still hundreds of thousands of ballots left to count and they'll be doing about 70,000 a day. So it could be early to middle of next week until we get those final election results. Reporting live at the Maricopa County Election Center, Brianna Whitney for Arizona's Family. Brianna